right now one of Hollywood's brightest and most beloved stars of all time, Tom Hanks. His new movie Hi, is Robin. Sully! Hi. Hi. Captain Sullenberger! Hello. The, the real life pilot. Can I just say, this is like doing an interview and baggage claim. There are so many people here. Everybody's kind of like hustling and screaming and trying to fake moving furniture around. We, we call it controlled chaos, Tom. Oh my, the, where, controlled where, chaos. I gotta go out in the line for taxi cabs and get to my next interview. <laughs> Oh, Lord. But you were able to pilot that miracle landing on the Hudson. Uh, you know, I, we, we did a fake version of that, and it was just nearly as spectacular as the, the real thing. Let's take a look. All right. Here we go. No relight after 30 seconds in your master one and two. Confirm off. Too low off. terrain. Too low terrain. Too low terrain. Too low terrain. This is the captain. Brace for impact. Yeah, my plane. Hard not my to plane. hard not to call the movie Brace mm. for Impact, but then you th then you think terrorists are involved or something like <laughs> that, true. so we didn't do it. But Sully is the right name for it. Oh you yeah, really, yeah, he's the man. You, you embody everything about this man. Why now? This happened in January of 2009. Yeah. Why, why do you think the timing is is now for the movie to come out, Tom? Well, I, I think, it, for you know, for larger philosophical reasons, I think it takes a look at uh, the social contract we have with our institutions. Mm. You know, there is a thing that is supposed to happen when you go to the airport and you have a ticket and you get on a plane and you fly from LaGuardia to Charleston, South Carolina. The worst thing that is supposed to happen is they lose your suitcase or uh, mm -hmm. you, you spill coffee on your lap. Uh, you're, the, you're supposed to be able to have faith in a guy and a crew, men and women who come on and say, sit back and we'll get you there without any problems. A problem came up, but they still got there in one form or another. And I, and I, and I think that's always a, 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 that's always a good American lesson mm -hmm. somehow, that we can have faith in our institutions. And so he was only concerned about the 155 souls on board. Do you know this? I saw it from my apartment. I was the second caller to 911 that morning. I think right. we have it. So, Rob, oh, really? Oh, yeah. Into the Hudson River, a U.S. Air. Oh, my gosh. I, go. I saw it, and you know, the only mistake that I made, that wasn't a crash landing. No, it, it was an emergency landing. Force water landing, Robin. Yeah. Uh, it's a very, yeah. very distinctive thing. <laughs> but, <laughs> but, but here's the thing. So you saw, uh, you saw a commercial airline plane flying low over the skyline of yes. Manhattan. So what did you think? I thought 9-11. Well, all there over. you go. Yeah, that, yeah. That's and look that. what happened mm -hmm. instead. I think mm -hmm. the amazing thing about the movie and what Sully did was what was avoided. New York City and America did not need to see another wrecked plane. And New York City needed... A story like this. It was like the timing. <laughs> it was of all good was, timing. It was, yeah, it was great timing. Yeah, yeah. And can I just the mustache? I'm oh, that scary you know, thing. That mustache that you wore for Sully. How did Rita, your your, your wonderful my, wife? My wife is so sick of the mustache era of my career <laughs> that uh, yeah. it, it's like the first question she asks again. Honey, I'm going to start a job in about six weeks. She says, Does this mean you're going to have to grow facial hair again? <laughs> and I say, First of all, calm down. Yeah. Secondly, the good news, it will be painted white every day. So mm -hmm. there, there's a advantage. To this. It looked great. It looked oh, great. Thanks, I, thanks. I follow you on social media. You are like this lost and found. If, me, if, oh. I, if I lose anything, yeah. I want you. <laughs> That's. I mean, gloves and ID. All the. I've, yes, what, yes. What, I, is, what is up with that? Well, Tom? you know, I actually. It, it's kind of like a comment on our transient society. I, one of the things I always ask questions. I once. I once. I don't know if it's up here, but I took a picture of a spatula in Times Square. <laughs> And I just thought, who loses a spatula in Times Square? There is a story behind that lost spatula that, I, you know, I, it's a mystery that I'm, I must solve. Uh, you I must, gotta get you, to you, it. You gotta get to the bottom of it. That's right. You know who we have coming up here? Uh, you have Meg, Meg Ryan. Ryan. I'm telling yes. you, you came this close to having America's Sweethearts reunited on, oh. on a set of Good Morning America. Oh. You, who books this show? There's Meg now. I, I love you, sweetie. I sweetie, I love you. Yeah, she's gonna I'll find you. I'll wait for you. you. Meet you in the park. Let's uh, let's have uh, hot dogs at that thing by the place with a deal, and we'll get to know each other again. Look at her, fantastic. If you, if you need a spatula, you know where to. Where I'll to meet find you at the spatula in Times Square. <laughs> but that's where her movie. Can I just point out something that this is so surreal? You see that Bubba Gump Shrimp Company right back? There? Oh yes! yes. All right. Wait, 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 wait. That used to be my bank where I cashed <laughs> unemployment checks. If you had told me in 1977 where I'm trying to cash $47 in a check from somebody who doesn't want to give me the cash, I wish I could have said, hey, this is going to be a restaurant based on my movie. <laughs>
for crying out loud. Come on, everybody, let's go get free appetizers on me. I'll meet you over there. He is like a box of chocolates. Uh, I'm telling you, a surprise, a surprise, a surprise. I love to read it. Everyone, I will, I will thank you, Tom. It. Thank you very much. Can we put him on the payroll and have him here? Yeah. Every yeah. Day? But in the meantime, get rid of the guy with a gap in his teeth, and I'll come in every day. <laughs> oh, sorry. Okay. Can somebody, can somebody not tell me that he's here for crying? I'm here. All right, that's it. I'm taking over the pyramid. We'll be right back. <laughs>